Lot 27, 10-7, crossbred by Van Gogh bounced. I love him built like this. This hog's skinny and in a good way. Uh, looks like he's going to be able to handle some gas when it counts because, man, uh, that is one bendy-legged, loose-built, tall-shouldered one that's got such a memorable look as you work right in on him. Uh, got a beautiful silhouette, really modern in terms of uh, his length of body and his upper hip design. And like I said, he's a little skinny when you step in behind him, but his pin set's broad, his chest is big. Looks like one that you're going to have a lot of fun feeding this summer because uh, he is going to handle absolutely everything you throw at him every step of the way. But look at this right here. I mean, this thing from the side, holy smokes. What a crazy looking animal that just doesn't have a tight joint in his body. Got an insane look, and man, uh, this looks like the kind that a guy could uh, look really, really smart buying at the end of the summer because uh, his feeding window and just his ability, and we've only seen the sister. I don't know how many of you guys are offering uh, out of this litter. This hog looks like the guilt we just, just got done doing, and I think even behind him, I think he's maybe just a little more opened up uh, in his hawk, but yet, like I said, he's skinny, uh, and I love that because uh, just a silly-looking critter here. Yeah, I'll borrow that a uh, little bit rawler in his muscle shape right now, but uh, study what matters, and that thing is good hipped. He's square pinned, uh, and then study him come right at you. He's true in the base of his chest. He's square about his knee. Uh, when that one gets right in his body shape, which I think will be easy to do out of that boar, uh, I think this thing's going to be wicked in the show ring. Lot 27, 10-7.